Today we're going to be talking about the Cardioline Microtel handheld and PC based ECG. It's the first in the industry to offer both um, a small compact handheld standalone EKG with a one lead preview screen uh, and keyboard as well as the ability to uh, pass real time data from the device to a computer. Um, you can see here the device is uh, very compact. It does have a um, single lead preview screen, um, a start, uh, send, and stop button, uh, the main menu button, a cell phone style keypad for entering patient data if you choose to on the device. Uh, you can always of course enter patient data on the software um, after you've taken the test uh, if you're using a standalone mode and uh, prior to taking the test if you're doing so in real time. Uh, go ahead and power on the device here and while I'm doing that uh, give you an idea of what the unit comes with. Uh, it does come with a full uh, user manual uh, as well as uh, universal clips uh, for the patient cable, uh, some sample electrodes uh, disposable style, uh, batteries for the machine and uh, a standard uh, uh, patient cable um, and some patient cable organizer clips inside. Uh, I'll do my best here in this video to show you, give you a, a, a demonstration of the PC connection option. So I have turned the device on um, and the unit comes with um, the Cardioline Cube software suite, uh, which I will go ahead and open. And we'll zoom in here just uh, a little bit. Uh, hopefully you can see that. Uh, it does prompt you uh, if you want to open it, go ahead. The password and username are MED1 uh, for both case, uh, MED in capitals and then the number one. So here is the uh, standard interface for the Cube software suite. Uh, up here in the left uh, you see new test, new patient, refresh, browse, uh, that's to browse the patient database, uh, archive to put it to a disk or elsewhere. Um, and uh, you see the patient name list as well as the patient tests for patients of that name, details on the patient, and test data. Uh, I'm going to uh, go ahead and press the, uh, have the device configured for real-time PC mode. So I'm going to go ahead and press the test button. Um, you could uh, enter the patient information here, but I'm just going to go ahead and send one over right now. Um, it does feature Bluetooth wireless technology, um, so it's going to give me a please wait until I press here on the computer screen, um, new test. Um, it's going to ask me what type of test it is. Uh, this particular software does support all of CardioLine's diagnostic equipment, uh, including Holter, Stress, 24 ABP. Um, so we'll go ahead and do an EKG test, which is what the Microtel is. Um, it's going to tell me to press the patient data or select uh, the patient. Um, I'm just going to use the next patient ID here. You could enter patient data at this point um, or search for an existing patient. Uh, I'll just create a new one. Um, it's going to ask you if you have any uh, specific indications or medications that you want to note. Um, and then it's going to tell me to power on the unit and check that the positions of the electrodes um, which in the, in the instance of this demo we're not going to do and hit next. At that point it should attempt to connect to the device. Uh, here we do have connected in the device screen and we do start to see a 12 lead preview. Um, this particular device and you know, the Bluetooth technology it's using um, has the range to work within the walls of most uh, standard size physicians offices. Uh, I've personally tested it here um, in our warehouse out to uh, about 100, 100 feet or so. Um, and I, I do know that that can get better. Uh, we've got concrete walls here, so um, the range is a little bit limited. But even, uh, even with the concrete walls, we get up to about 110, 120 feet in distance from the device. Um, so at this point, uh, it has begun uh, capturing uh, ECG data. You can see here that all you're getting is uh, some flat lines, a little bit of noise as I move the machine around. I don't have a patient cable plugged in, so it is presenting uh, a little bit of noise, but I think you get the idea uh, regarding the uh, real-time data transmission. Um, from here, you can save uh, a 10-second strip um, and uh, get a full-page interpretive report that you can save as a PDF and upload to your EMR. Um, 
Alternately, if you wanted to use the device away from a computer as a standalone 12 lead EKG, you can do so. Uh, you put the device into um, a digital ECG mode, uh, take the test on the device, enter the patient data or um, simply the uh, ID of the patient. Uh, then at that point you can um, uh, take a full test, save it in the internal memory of the device and upload it at any point later to the CardioLine QBCG software suite um, to, be, uh, to be converted to a PDF or saved to your EMR suite. Uh, Cardiac Direct is really pleased to be the first to offer this device. Um, we feel that it is uh, uh, going to change uh, um, how people look at PC-connected equipment, its ease of use, its range, and its um, uh, pretty neat form factor uh, make it a popular choice. If you have any questions, please feel free to give us a call, 888-354-2968. We have agents standing by to answer any of your questions and offer you discounted pricing on the CardioLine Microtel.